From the administration point of view, a laboratory is created to support a very well-defined objective, an effort of an organization, a university, a private business. This objective or these objectives are defined in the laboratory mission statement. Every activity in the lab is oriented toward the mission. So the administration will be instrumental in determining the services that the lab offers. The administration will determine the users, the clientele that will have access to the services. The administration will be instrumental in the funding of the laboratory services and if the services will be provided to whom and at what cost. The administration will delegate to the laboratory manager who will oversee the lab that the lab has instruments, reagents, and chemicals needed to fulfill the mission of the laboratory. The administration knows and must let everyone in the lab know that any lab must provide accurate, reliable, repeatable results to be trusted by its clientele and by the scientific researchers at large at the local, regional, and international level depending on the mission mentioned above. The administration must ensure that all lab equipment is in working order to support those accurate, reliable, repeatable results. They must ensure that the proper qualified personnel is hired to manage the laboratory. The administration must ensure that enough personnel is hired to do the research. They must understand the science needed to support the lab mission. The personnel must be able to manage the laboratory day to day to ensure that all instruments are in working order that there is enough reagents and chemicals to get the job done, and that all data is acquired, recorded, saved, and processed. A lab can elevate or demote the reputation of the institution. When the lab provides accurate, re reliable, repeatable results in support of solid research publications, word gets around very quickly. Word gets around even faster when laboratory results are not accurate, reliable, and repeatable, and this organization's reputation will suffer. So every time a researcher, supported by good science and good data, is accepted for publications, the pub rep reputation of the lab and the organization is strengthened. The devil is in the details, they say. The same goes for a research laboratory.